Tonight, a sickening find at the gravesite of a prominent South Australian. Seven News was there as police dug it up. Good evening. Police are investigating whether a possible family feud is behind a sickening attack on the gravesite of late property tycoon Con Polites. A shocking discovery was made beneath the ground hours after a sinister package was delivered to Mr Polites' son. Kneeling at the Centennial Park gravesite of Con Polites, police watch on as a cemetery worker begins digging. They know exactly what they're looking for. A crime scene officer records the moment a pet carrier is pulled from the dirt, a dead cat inside it wrapped in a towel. Seven News has been told it was a message to the family, deliberately buried there in recent days, desecrating the 15-year-old plot. Down at the beachside home of Con Polite's son George, more police and another delivery. This time a bowl, adorned with a red ribbon, dropped off at 3.55 this morning. It's understood it contained a fresh animal liver, a birthday candle and a handwritten note. As police examined the scene, George Polites emerged to talk to them before leaving a short time later in his Rolls Royce. The house has top level surveillance, cameras captured the delivery and the video is being carefully scrutinised. It's suspected the bizarre discoveries may be part of a long running dispute involving a relative and that police are also investigating the acid bombing of two cars. Court records show the Polites group took out an intervention order against a family member in September last year. Five years ago, the house was peppered with bullets in an attack George Polites described as mistaken identity. And Jessica Adamson joins us now live from Glenelg North. Jess, what are police saying? Well, Jane, they're not saying much at all except to confirm that they are investigating this disturbing matter. They say officers came to the home this morning to examine the suspicious package and determined it posed no risk to the public. It's understood the Pilates family has told police who they believe is responsible, but of course proving it is another matter. The security video and the handwritten note could hold the key. John. Police have been called in after another ugly confrontation between the Polites group and the man the family suspects is fueling a bitter feud. It comes as bombshell court documents reveal family secrets and years of death threats, attacks and abuse. This is the man George Polites believes is ruining his life, his nephew Marcus Salkanovich. As Polites workers pulled down fences around his rented home, he hit back, pelting them with dirt and stones. Salkanovich called police in another chapter of what court records reveal is a long and nasty dispute over money. They allege Salkanovich has abused George Polites multiple times in the past by phone and in person. He's suspected of egging an apartment owned by Polites and of putting up posters calling him a pedophile. Among the text messages sent to George, your days are numbered, you I'll kill you. You stole the Range Rover and evict me. Now you accuse me of egging and ban me from seeing my mother. Your father would be turning in his grave and your mental stability to be CEO has come into question. Go yourself, Lucifer. All will be revealed on TV. We will never stop. And this, we will expose you soon. We know your secret. Last year, a magistrate ruled the events caused George Polites emotional and psychological harm, distress, anxiety and fear. As a result, he upped security around his home and at work. His sister Helen was too upset to talk today. You must be pretty distressed at everything that's happening with the family. Yes, I am. On Tuesday, police found a cat buried at the gravesite of Con Polites. Hours earlier, an animal organ with a birthday candle was delivered to George's home. The investigation into those incidents and whether Salkanovich has any connection with them is continuing. Jessica Adamson, 7 News.